Okay, so let's get this started. Um, just tell me a little bit about yourself. Tell me your name, your major, and what position you're running for. Uh, my name is Verna Chan, and I'm a second year uh, economics and administrative studies major, and I'm running for CHAS Senator. Pride, we really want to boast a more positive campus environment. Um, so like whether you're a first year, fourth year student, faculty member, parent, whatever, we just want you to be proud to be like part of the Highlander family, to be part of UCR. And one of the ways we did that this year was that we gave our gear to all the first years because having campus pride isn't wearing UCLA, UCSB, USC sweatshirts. It's having UCR across your chest. Um, the second one, progress. We really want to partner with the local community and government so that um, student government can enact change, that we have kind of enforcement or like backing and just like more resources open to the campus. And um, third, empowerment. We wanna empower communities through self-representation and self-determination. Um, and it's oftentimes hard to do that because students don't have access to those resources. So what um, student government should do is be like that direct like, um, place that student could get, students could get resources. And so we want to streamline everything so that um, students don't need to keep jumping through hoops to get things that they need um, to kind of like get rid of the bureaucracy. Yeah. And uh, can you describe the, the purpose of the position that you're applying for? Um, so I feel like CHAS Senator. I represent um, obviously CHAS College. <laughs> um, but it's doing what um, the CHAS student body wants. So whether like my opinion matches theirs or not, I'm ultimately representing them. I'm representing the student body of CHAS College. And what makes you qualified to be a CHAS senator? Um, I'm a second year and I'm the president of Sigma Kappa, so I feel like I have uh, a lot of leadership abilities. I'm very opinionated and um, most importantly, I feel like I'm unbiased to a lot of things. So when uh, I get put into situations, I take both sides into consideration to make a justified decision. Um, and that's important because like I said, whether it aligns with my opinion or not, I'm representing something bigger than me. I'm representing the students, the constituents, you. <laughs> and why are you running for the position? Um, I feel like in my two years here, UCR has given me so much. And I've seen like all the change that uh, student government has brought and I feel like it's time for me to give back and time for me to be a part of it. And um, so you mentioned that you were running to be a CHAS senator, correct? Um, can you just tell me about one Senate resolution that was previously passed that you either liked or disliked? Um, I mean, <laughs> did you want to move on to the next question? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Um, so if you were to become elected for the position, what's one specific goal that you have and how would you accomplish it? Um, I want to create more jobs on campus because for students like me who like kind of don't really have like a car, it's hard to get jobs because on-campus jobs are mainly reserved for work-study kids or work-study students. So for people like me who don't qualify for like financial aid or work-study, I'm kind of, it's like a catch-22 because Riverside, you need a car to go to places. And so not having a car, kind of, I can't get a job, but I need a job to get a car. So that type of thing. Okay. Um, so I think that's all I have for you today. Thank you very much for coming in again. And, uh, good luck in your campaign. <laughs> Thank you.